Okay, welcome back to class. Genius Kiddies got you and Matty Mattis. All right. So, we are still on percentage. And uh, we are going to be looking at a little bit of uh, changing marks, you know, in our students. And uh, sometimes, most times in our work, we we'll get um, a certain mark out of a particular, a particular mark. So, we have a case study on the board, talking about Kenneth, he had some marks in his test. We are seeing spellings, he got 13 out of 20, mathematics, he got 20 out of 25, and in reading, he got 7 out of 10. We are going to see what percentage we are changing it to what fraction, to, um, to percentage. So, you know, this is fraction already, 13 out of 20. So, let's quickly get all of this change to percentage. So, spelling. We'll be having him, I told you what percentage is. Since we are converting, we are going to be multiplying by a hundred. To be multiplying by a hundred. So for spelling, it's going to be 13 times 100. In mathematics, when you're multiplying by either 100, 1,000, 10, just consider the zero at the back. So 13 times 100 is 13. And this one zero, second zero, write it. It does not need so much calculation. If, if you multiply it out, you will see that you'll be getting this answer I mentioned. So 20 times 1. That's 20. At this stage, we are close. So, 0 can actually take 0 out. We are left with 130 divided by 2. We can have it this way. So, 13 divided by 2, that's 6. 2 times 6 is 12. You know, we, we, sub, we subtract. 10 divided by 2, that's 5. 2 times 5 is 10. So, we have this as our final answer, 65%. So, in spellings, Kenneth got 65%. I hope that's clear. Then, the second one in Martin Murphy's. Kenneth, what did you, what's your percentage? We have 20 out of 25 times a hundred times one over one so we multiply out 20 times remember what i did 20 and this two zero one two one two over 25 so you can divide like the way i did actually five can divide but then let's go this way we have 25, we have 2,000. So 25 in 200, that's 8. 25 times this, that's 200. And we have 0 left, so we have 0. So for mathematics, Kenneth got 80%. Wow, awesome. Kenneth must be brilliant. We, do, we have reading left. Reading, Kenneth got 7 out of 10, multiplied by 100 over 1. So, 7 times 100, 7, 1, 2, that's 700. Then 10 times 1, that's 10. Then we can divide, 0 can actually cancel 0, 70 over 1, that's 70 so in reading Kenneth got 70 percent I hope this has been able to do justice on how to convert fraction to percentage and percentage to fraction we can also convert decimal to percentage we'll do that as a separate video if you enjoyed this lesson make sure you subscribe you share you comment and your feedback is very important to us and you can be sure you get the very best. Thank you.